A bill that closes a campaign financial loophole for Mississippi's public service commissioners is now law. It restricts representatives for renewable energy companies like wind and solar to donate to commissioners and candidates for office. Now, 12 News previously reported on questionable campaign donations received by public service commissioners Brent Bailey, Diane Maxwell, and then former Democratic gubernatorial nominee Brandon Presley. Now, at the time, those donations did not violate PSC campaign guidance law. The law now bars any individual representing a public utility company, including renewal energy companies, from donating to commissioners and candidates. Senator Joel Carter introduced the bill in the Senate and says it was a win for ratepayers. Anybody that's, that's regulating uh, energy and it has a direct effect on ratepayers, we feel like uh, there shouldn't be any outward influence on that. When it comes to the Public Service Commission and the staff, uh, we took the position that the ratepayers are directly affected by those decisions, and so those should be the people that are donating to those campaigns, not anyone that is producing any type of utility. We will have more on this legislation and the impact of it coming up at 12 News at 6.